Here at home, it was a big blow to conservatives on the State Board of Education today as they put their final stamp of approval on science lessons that will soon make their way into the classrooms of Texas. Questions were raised about one publisher in particular and their approach to the theory of evolution. KXA's Aaron Cargill is live with reaction from all sides. Aaron? Talking about the new online lessons that schools will use to help prepare students for new standards covered on the state's end of the year test. Now, this avoids the expense of buying brand new textbooks. Leading up to this week, the material put out by publishers went through an intense review process. One in particular passed the test with the understanding they may have to change a few things. I'll give you my assurance that we'll, we'll provide you documentation. The State Board of Education avoided a showdown Friday on evolution, leaving those who support mainstream teaching. For the first time in many years, the students of Texas and science had a victory, and those with conservative views happy. Thank God the State Board of Education said we've got to make a change. Someone chosen to review publisher Holt McDougall's material said there were several errors in labs, including a comparison between chimpanzee and human skulls, fossils, and the makeup of cells. Instead of throwing out the publisher's materials altogether, we're going to record vote. The board unanimously voted to approve it on one condition let the Education Commission. Commissioner decide the best way to reword it. I know there are two sides to this issue, and, and I can't promise either side that they will be happy. I'm just going to try to find some way to, I think, best articulate the information in a fair way. Some board members already like how it looks and don't want to see anything change. If we water down the science in this product, then we'll be doing a disservice to kids and we won't be doing our job to prepare them for college. In the end, it is still school districts who make the final call on whose curriculum ends up in their classrooms. The board recommended 91 other products to choose from. Commissioner said he'll either do his own research or consult with scientists and science teachers to figure out the best wording for the material in question. Live in the studio, Erin Cargile, KXAN News.